Detroit. Hello, I'm Martin Escher from the Volkswagen Driving Experience. Today we'll have a look at the convenient automatic parking assistant that can help you parallel park your car. When using the parking assistant, it's important to understand that the parking assistant only helps with the steering. That means that you as the driver are responsible for the speed of your vehicle and for braking. The accelerator and brake pedal still control the car, so you are in charge of the speed. All the assistant does is take over the steering for you. When looking for a parallel parking space, you drive along the row of parked cars and the assistant looks for a suitable space. Once it has found a space that's large enough, it indicates it, and your car asks you to engage the reverse gear. Then the assistant takes over the steering, while you control the speed and the brakes. You should watch the display screen and monitor the position of the vehicle using the side mirrors, always following the instructions displayed in the multifunctional display screen. Now the instructions say to put the car in forward and leave your foot on the brake until the steering wheel has turned into the proper position. Then the car moves forward, tells me the parking assistant is complete and I should take over the steering again. And we are in the parking space. The parking steering assistant not only helps us get into a parallel parking space, it can also help us get out. I get in the car, start the engine, put the car in reverse, activate the switch, and the car tells me to turn on my blinker to indicate which direction I want to go. Then the steering assistant takes over. I carefully release the brake and the car begins to move into the position shown. I put the car in forward gear and it moves into a position from which we can drive out of the parking space. After checking for oncoming traffic, I can leave the parking space in a single move. The second functionality we want to look at is backing into a diagonal parking space. To do this, we drive along a row of parked cars and activate the assistant. The assistant looks for a suitable parking space, which is then indicated up here in the multifunctional display screen. Now we have a diagonal parking space we can back into. Just what we need. The steering assistant is activated. While backing up, I monitor the display screen, keeping an eye on the mirrors and the park sensor indicators to make sure we are safe at all times. And then the multifunctional display screen tells me what I have to do. In this case, I should put the car in forward. Now the car is telling me to brake and put the car in reverse. Then the final adjustments are made and we are safely in the parking space in our final position. The third functionality of the Parking Steering Assistant 3.0 is pulling into a diagonal parking space. A problem can arise here, namely that when I pull into the parking space and notice I didn't start from the right angle, I can get stuck in the space. In this case, I don't activate the parking assistant until I have entered the parking space. The assistant then takes over the steering for me, brings me into the proper starting position for the respective parking space. In the multifunctional display, the assistant tells me whether to back up or drive forward and whether I should hit the brakes. And so it brings me into the right starting position for the parking space and before you know it, we're parked and the car is properly aligned in the parking space. Those were the three options offered by the convenient parking assistant feature. Please be aware that you, the driver, are always responsible for the vehicle even when using these features. Remember, you can always override the feature by taking over the steering wheel or applying the brakes. If you have any questions about these features, please refer to your operator's manual. Volkswagen.